shit is about to go down. But before you call us crazy, I gotta explain to you how any of what you're about to witness is even possible. A few weeks ago, we got invited to Will Smith's house, and Amar, with the help of his skydiving instructor, Sean McCormack, showed up in probably the most outrageous way possible. Y'all know I'm about to do the bungee jump for my birthday over the Grand Canyon, so I was asking my man, Sean McCormack, I was like, yo, why don't you come help me out with the jump? And I should have known something was weird when he didn't ask for an address. He asked for coordinates. Uh oh, there's smoke. This is really, really insane. Whoa! <laughs> That's crazy! I love it. Yeah. Yo. I love it. It's the first time anyone's ever entered my property that way. Yeah. Now the relevance of this in our story isn't the skydive itself, but the helicopter pilot that took us there, Aaron Fitzgerald. Aaron is one of the only four pilots in the world with the skill set to perform helicopter acrobatics, which is exactly as crazy as it sounds. And since Amar will be the one representing Yes Theory and the Heli Bungee with Will Smith on September 25th, he wanted to surprise Matt and I with our own unique helicopter stunt, but we had absolutely no idea what he had planned for us. I'm thinking it's a peaceful day where they meditate and read. Can you come for a second? You know it's important when Amar dresses up before 10 a.m. <laughs> Just wait. Where were you wrong? I, I told you about the, what Sean did skydiving into Wilson's backyard, but I never told you about the heli pilot who took us there. Since you guys won't be jumping on September 25th, I thought, what is the craziest experience that you can get in a helicopter? And I think I found it. Let's go in the living room and I will show you a quick glimpse of what we'll be doing in about an hour and a half. Well, that's Christ, dude. This is an intense setup. This is my new friend Aaron. He's the guy that took us over Will's house. He's one out of four heli pilots in the whole entire world who can do this. <laughs> what the f? Dude, what? How dangerous is this? Don't ask a lot Dude, of let's go! I've never seen this in my life. Yeah, because there's four people in the world who do it, and he's one of them. It goes like <laughs> backwards and like. You're laughing so now, but I'm fing processing this shit. Yeah, these. so like, this is usually their action. Matt gets too hyped and Thomas thinks about death. That's I'm right. seeking discomfort, not seeking f***ing death. <laughs> I think I would be more scared doing this than doing a heli bungee. Great. Alright, cool, well. I'll see you myself. guys later. I'll uh, <laughs> be hiding in the bathroom. <laughs> My fear is that either you or I throw up on him and then he loses his sight and then we crash. Shut up, dude. Why are we <laughs> thinking about all these f***ing scenarios? It is a legitimate fear. It is a legitimate fear. <laughs> Do you guys ever feel like plastic bags? We rarely do stunts for our videos. It's interesting that this month is just about using helicopters to scare the shit out of ourselves. Literally. Look at that. Oh my god. Welcome, I'm Aaron. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. I already know you. What's happening? What are the what's the what are the what's the deal? <laughs> what, do you know what you're in for? Yeah, they showed us showed us the video. Are you nervous? Anybody nervous? What is there to be nervous about? Yeah, no. He's <laughs> in a tree right now. He climbed up a tree hiding. I don't want to do it. But you can't just sit up in that tree and hang out. That's totally natural. I was too the first time. Yeah. Okay. okay. Sweet. How it's you fine. Now? You'll see. It's a lot. I'm good now. Don't worry. Okay. <laughs> How many people have done this before? I've personally taken only four or five people. Red Bull people and other helicopter pilots, other air show performers, people like that. Okay. <laughs> wow. <laughs> the two noobs. My fear is just throwing up. Uh, yeah, that's a possibility for sure. Okay. Uh, it won't ruin the experience for you. If you get sick, then. But I just don't want to throw up on like you and blind you. You know. We definitely don't want that. Yeah. yeah we're so gonna give you a bag. <laughs> okay. So, uh, yeah. <laughs> I don't want to throw up on you. You're like. Yep. Don't do that, buddy. <laughs> Hi, my name's Aaron Fitzgerald. I'm the Red Bull Aerobatic Helicopter Pilot here in the United States. I've been flying for about 24 years. Got about 8,500 hours, somewhere in that neighborhood. I'm one of four people uh, who have the aerobatic license issued by the FAA to do aerobatics in a helicopter. Do you consider this dangerous or not? Sometimes. Yeah. <laughs> the answer is that it's an adventure. It's a, it's just a thrill to do it, and I'm and I'm privileged, and I'm I'm happy to take people along. Yeah, we're about to do heli acrobatics. Oh, who are these guys? Who are the pilots? 
Just don't tell mom yet, all right? If you start to feel sick, it's not going to get better. So you got, you got to tell me. Don't gut it out thinking, oh, I'll feel better in a second. You won't. <laughs> Just let me know. But you're going to be fine. You'll see. It's really gentle. It's not, it's not violent. It's not a fighter jet. Right, let's do it. Let's have some fun. Woo! up and then it goes down and then all the blood comes back up and then it goes down. You got, now you got your heli experience. Matt and I got ours. Yeah. Now it's your turn. Thank you to this man. Thank you guys for coming. Absolute legend. Super fun sharing yeah. it with you guys. You also tell me to the Grand Canyon.